We now turn to new technology, hoping to crack down on some speeding through construction zones. Yeah, a new five-year pilot program is launching after getting approval last year. Fox 59's Scarlett O'Hara walks us through how it's going to work. Scarlett? Along with those orange cones, drivers here in Hancock County will soon see some new signs going up on I-70, letting them know they're on camera. Cameras will automatically snap photos of license plates on any cars going at least 11 miles per hour over the limit in this construction zone. Your first violation will get you a warning. Speed again and you'll find a $75 fine in the mail. Every infraction after that will cost 150 bucks. There was a truck that flipped over last week on the highway and the construction zone. Where at? It was here? It was here. Safety is the reason INDOT officials say they're launching the program, approved by state lawmakers last year. They hope to slow drivers, reduce crashes, and save lives. Truck driver Raymond Hines believes it's a good idea, even saying he'd like to see more police on the highway. You always got to be on guard because you never can tell who's going to cut, cut in front of you because trucks can't stop on a dime, so we have to really give ourselves a lot of room. But not everyone agrees. Everyone's talking about it. The camera's going up. As a, they're not, it's not going to do nothing but compound the chaos. This truck driver worries the cameras will prove too distracting, saying construction zone traffic is already a nightmare in central Indiana. It's nuts for the truck drivers because as soon as they go up, all the people are going to be conscientious about what's happening. They're going to be looking towards them. They're going to try to slow down and pull over and merge lanes and that. INDOT says it'll announce three more work sites getting cameras later this year. And for the next five years, they'll be giving lawmakers feedback on how the program is going. There'll be continued conversations around the topic, around the program, and there is potential for it to become a permanent program. The cameras will go up during the pre-enforcement period starting August 14th, and during that time, drivers will only be sent warnings. In Hancock County, Scarlett O'Hara, Fox 59 News. Coming up.